I did end up going two and one last week. So let's see what what place are we in? I think it says it on here actually somewhere. Maybe it's not somewhere you guys can see. Oh yeah, I'm, num <laughs> I'm number 69, guys. Woo! <laughs> I should have put that on here. I would have gotten so many clicks. We will see how it goes, folks. All right, let's let's uh, let's get going, shall we? We may have gone 2-1 last round, but that's not how it is here. This is another... Hopefully, if we can beat this guy, that'll be three people in a row who have beat me that I have then gotten revenge on in my second match. So, that would be nice. Like a, So, one thing I want to point out, it's, it's impressive. And this guy did beat me like a rug last time. Um, Though, I was on vacation and I, I really barely tried. Really, like, I I mean, I, I like went in and attacked, but I didn't scout, didn't, didn't, didn't do anything. Uh, good player, though. He's usually in, like, the top 20-ish, so... Uh, yeah, he's uh, he's a Kyber contender though, which means at some point he got number 10 or better in his group, which is very impressive. Top 10 is very, very difficult to get uh, back way back in the day. This title doesn't actually, it's not something you can earn anymore, which is pretty dumb that they did that, but he's, he should wear it proudly. That's a very, very difficult one to earn. <laughs> Getting revenge on everyone he's lost to. Quest Cape, that's the goal every time. You know what? Something I want to do, though, guys. I want to see if he has Afra. I didn't actually look. I didn't scout today either. Actually, I'm. I think I'm gonna just never scout again. Actually, because I spend spend a lot of time scouting, and it just like mixes me up so much that it doesn't actually do anything for me. I think that's my theory. Okay, he does have Afra. Oh, he has two Omicrons for him. What, what about the murder bots? He has the, he has one murder bot. There's no Omicron there. Okay, now Omicron's on the murder bots, but they are Relic 7. And he has Hondo. I, yeah, I don't know what he's capable of, guys. He's probably gonna just destroy me, but it'll be good. What's this, the old contender title here? Yeah, it's impressive, right, Rukarin? So here's what I've placed. You'll note that I've, no, I've started working on my Ben solo a little bit. Um, he was Relic 5 for a long time. I remodded him. Got him a bunch more offense and potency. He is a little less healthy. Poor, poor guy. But he's Relic 7 now instead of 5, because I kept forgetting to put Relics on him. And he's good. Good enough to warrant them. Um, I also have Afra and her murder bots. They're actually Relic 6 right now. I just relic them after lock. So yeah, so I placed Afra on defense this time. Because uh, I was too afraid to use her on anything else, really. Um, I'm just, I'm just not... Not good with it, apparently. Uh, we have a uh, Qui-Gon team here, as per usual. And actually, guys, the one highlight of my match with Jujman last time. Gosh, I need to stop saying it like that. I'm not trying to mock. I really not. But la last time I faced Jujman, uh, he he did actually he did actually fail on my Qui-Gon team like nine times. He still beat me because I couldn't clear him or something. I don't remember. I was on vacation, but. He, uh, he did struggle mightily on this team. I, it, he actually, I think the video's still posted somewhere. Um, I think he got one of his friends to post the video and do commentary on it. So, it was all in French. It was, it was very difficult for me to follow. In fact, impossible. But, it was, it was cool to see. And then, of course, he won. So, I didn't, you know, I didn't feel kindly disposed toward that video. But, I did like that segment, at least. Let's see, I placed Malgus here with... Uh, the these two the the Darth Revan duo or some, whatever you want to call them um and then General Skywalker thing is I I don't know how he's using Treya actually I, I have no idea I I don't know if he's using Treya to good effect or not it's gonna be very interesting all right up top we have Sana here with, with the good friends. Uh, we have oh, we have Sorty with her double phallus head bros. We've got the Bosk team that times some people out for some reason. Uh, we've got Adrad and uh, General Grievous with some kind of droid cron on it. I like how Salacious Crumb is just sitting here in the middle, just like playing. It's like a little playground. Everyone like lets their little holographic children go out and play out there and some of them are like crazy they're like but don't venture past the end of the the 
rhombus or whatever the hell this shape is. You know, don't play with the enemy's children. Holographic children. <laughs> uh, so he's got Jabba here with, with Kerr Santin. Santin the Kerr. Crumb is like the troll of the playground. <laughs> yeah, he kind of is. He's a Kowakian monkey lizard. So he plays on, you can play on the monkey bars or on the lizard bars. You can do either one. Okay, so this Malagas team is wide open and I don't know what to do against it, frankly. I have a ton of options against it. And that's something we're gonna have to figure out because I, I don't want to get too fancy, but at the, on the other hand, I don't want to, like we can't use a GL on this. There's just no way we want to use a GL on that because we don't have many GLs. Uh, it's a it's a big GL. It's a big GL. I, that wasn't very good. Um, here's a Qui-Gon team. So he got the right idea. He started using this team. We got to find out a way to beat this. There's a Lord Vader. So check this out, guys. This one this one is sneaky as hell. So we've got IPD here, and what happens is if you kill IPD early, then uh, let's see if there's at least one other active ally. Revi revive all other defeated allies and other allies. Recover 100% health and protection and gain 100% turn meter and 100% offense until the end of the battle. So Lord Vader would immediately get 100% offense if we kill IPD. Or, uh, you know, if we kill, if we kill IPD... Yeah, if we kill him early, he gets 100% offense. If not, then he just revives Lord Vader. So, it's a pretty tricky one, but I mean, I think I have a pretty good comp for it. It's kind of funny, because I think Solo and I had the same idea. Because I was like, okay, well, I see this, and I think I'm going to use this this team for it. And he was like, oh, that's what I'm going to use. And then he went and did it, and it worked. So, I was like, nice. Free testing. IPD usually blow usually just blows himself up. That's that's too bad. Anticlimactic for old I ipped. I mean if you kill him first, then he just died. Like he doesn't I don't think he revives anyone, I hope. As we'll see. Um Then we, we've got this um we've got this Darth Revan team. And it's got the revive Kron on Dark Side tanks. And I'm still cause I'm like maybe we could use troopers here, because if we put the droid no revive thing on them. I might just be able to kill Malgus with droid, uh, with the the droid guy and, and then still win. I'm not sure. Not sure how that's gonna work out. If it's gonna pan out, in fact. Alright, um, and then up top he's got a Dooku squad with Savage. Oh, is this a Revive Kron? Well, the Revive Kron, yeah, it just gets turn meter, because the Revive Kron wouldn't do anything for Savage. He's not actually a, he's not a, actually a tank. Even though he's being repurposed as a tank, he's not technically a tank. Let's see, so there's a Commander Luke squad here. Uh, Ray with, with Ben and Sorty. Um, and then there's there's the whole 501st all together in one little family, except for Snips, who's apparently at this moment being being on she's like on trial for for things she didn't do, and it was obvious that she didn't do them. So you know, she's about to leave the Jedi Order forever. What should we do first? There's a lot of really obvious kills here, counters for us. Uh, the one that I don't know about is Malgus. We could use a lot of different teams that I think have a decent success rate. I think we probably... Uh, why don't we just start killing teams, and when we get to... We'll, we'll get it down to Malgus, like to basically to the Sith Empire segment, and then we'll figure out what we want to do from there. Um, that being said, this one isn't... The most obvious. This one's gonna be a little tricky, actually. Um, how fast are these guys? Let's see. Let's check it out. Qui Gon is quick. He's at 370. All right, so they're all gonna be fast. Katie Mundy's gonna be plus 80 speed here. Uh, yeah, 263. Okay, so they're they're fast. They are quick. There's no denying that. So, we're just going to do the thing that we always do, I, I suppose. I, I don't know if this is going to work. That, I always feel like maybe this won't work this time. And then, usually does, but... Okay, so, let, let's see, what kind of cron are they wearing? 
One that does a lot of crit damage and has some defense. Okay. New Jingo B1 Cheese. Well, I wonder how thick this Qui-Gon is. I wonder if that's going to be a factor. Yeah, he's got he's got health here. And then... Oh, he didn't really stack health or protection. That's good. You just never know how, how much damage will these guys do. Um... <clears throat> I don't know, we could do something with a droid, I guess. Like, ability block for a droid. It's kind of fun, actually. If the droid deals damage, it can apply, can affect ability block. It's kind of good. I think maybe I'm just missing a Kron that... Looks like I don't have a droid Kron that denies revives, actually, now that I'm just looking at it real quick, so... What other things are we getting from this Kron? Let's see, we have crit damage, which we'll, that's a, I guess that helps Jingo. Crit chance, crit avoid. Oh, the crit avoid is, that's actually a lot. You guys can't see it. Here, I'll deprive you of my lovely face for one second. 55% crit avoid is actually a substantial amount. Huh, I didn't realize I'd rolled one that had that much. That's, a, that's pretty interesting though, because well, like, how much how much crit chance does does Anakin have, for instance? I guess he has a crit chance set on, but even still, he's only at 101. Like, he's, he's probably not going to even crit all us all of the way. Uh, interesting. All right, guys, let's see how this goes. I I don't know. I'm always I always feel pretty sketch. So they're going to get all their turns first. And if they manage to kill, oh, damn it all, they killed Newt first. That is not good at all. Shoot, man. If they kill, if they already killed Newt once, yeah, we're, oh, they did, that didn't kill him, though. Wow. All right, well, that's cool, I guess. Um, wow, okay. Let's see if we can just nuke him here. No, not quite. Um, okay, we can call the mass assist, though. That'll be good. That's a neat trick. Okay, he paid his extortion like a good lad. Okay, um... I don't know, this is kind of a weird situation, actually. Set him on fire, perhaps? I think just doing some shots on Anakin might actually be helpful. Yeah, and getting that ability block was good, in fact. They might still kill Newt pretty easily, though. Oh, they killed Jenga once? Oh, they killed him again? Yikes. That's not good. We needed Django, guys. Needed Django. Come on. Kill Anakin, please. Please just kill him right now. Please. I'm begging you. Please kill him. Okay, I think this will just kill him. Yeah, there we go. Alright, Kiati Mundi wasting shots here. Good. Good, good, good. Got ability block on him. Call the mass assist on him. I don't know if we have enough to actually kill him, guys. He's just stuck in this stance. He's going to hit us back and heal himself every time he does. Because we're just uh, ability blocking him every time. Every damn time, guys. I don't know. It seems like we're kind of making some progress here, in fact. This is just a weird fight. We're pretty damn close here. I think this might do it. Never a doubt. Well, that was pretty, that was actually decently clean, folks. <laughs> for, for what it was. For the fact that they just killed Jingo instantly. He's like, hey, I'm available for death. They're like, very well, we'll kill you. Okay, so. Lord Vader. <clears throat> he's got he's got a lot of defense on this Kron as well, though. I think I think the team we're gonna take is gonna mostly just kind of ignore that. Um, so we're gonna take Fennec with Grief and Mando. And the idea is we'll get our we'll get our bounty right away, our contract right away. Mando can just snipe out Royal Guard and then we just kill Lord Vader and just ignore IPD until it's just IPD. And then we can kill IPD, you know, however we want, and he won't revive everyone, because that's just not how it works, apparently. Apparently he won't revive everyone if he's the last one alive or something. 
She's like, what, why, what's the point? But uh, we do have, we probably have some bounty hunter one that actually helps us some, huh? Gives us some armor or something. I don't know, I guess we have a couple scoundrel ones. Which one is the one we want to use? So we have ability block and we have blinded. That one is turn meter, this one is turn meter. Oh, this has crit damage on it. This has some offense and some protection, defense, crit. I think I like this one better for us. And then the other one we can just ability block AoE with, with can the candy team, the, can the actual Candorous team. But I like the idea of, I guess blind doesn't do anything against Lord Vader though, does it? Hmm. Can use this one. The crit damage is kind of just wasted on him, though. I guess all the extra defense is kind of nice, though. Keeps us alive a little bit. It's a lot of Kron, says Hippie Artist. I go a little all out on this account for sure. All right, so Fennec has more offense than she used to have, guys, which is nice. Um, because because she doesn't have the accuracy arrow anymore, she doesn't need it. So hopefully we we can get a contract immediately. He'll do his force crush. Grief will go first. He'll give us all, he'll put us all into contract, and Mando will just snipe out. I guess it'll take a couple turns for Mando to be able to snipe someone out, but he'll be able to snipe out that Royal Guard. We'll call it good, hopefully. He'll be using L3 as a third, says Van Seal. I feel like you've told me that before. I think it's, it's a good idea. I just, uh, for the IPD one, I really need someone who can just kill this Royal Guard immediately. So, let's see. Will this get us our contract? I actually don't know if it will. Let's see, seven each? Yeah, it will. Yeah, okay, so we're not gonna quite get it here. Um, so let's do this. Oh, okay, so IPD blew himself up. Uh-oh. That's not good, folks. That's not good at all. The Mando died already. Um, okay, we're gonna, gotta cut a little mass assist here so that Mando can get the snipe here. Okay, hopefully... Hopefully, Lord, Lord Vader is looking a little bit feistier than I was hoping for. I hope he didn't get 100% offense, because that, that would that would make me feel a little bit sketched out, to be honest. Uh, though, I mean, I think he's the one who should feel sketched out. We just kicked him right in the nuts. Wow, that was really easy. <laughs> I, I did not know he would die that easy. So we have the Kron that can't be defeated by an enemy thing. We also have crit damage, which actually is relevant against Jabba. We have a bunch of extra health. So it should be good to go. It's just, just so silly. Like, Chrysanthemum usually takes a minute and a half to two minutes to kill in totality. And this just lets us immediately get a kill like so Kenobi goes Jabba goes Boosh takes about 10 minutes of clock I guess Chrysanthemum got a turn already wow look at you fast Chrysanthemum that was the last thing you'll ever do though all right so Chrysanthemum's not coming back because we have the duel can't revive when a scoundrel kills you Kron and so that's cool that's pretty neat Apparently we're still in the business of missing whenever we can, whenever we find that possible. Gosh, this is a lot of thermals on old cat though. That makes me uncomfortable. Jeez, you gotta stop. You gotta knock that off. Gosh, seven, that is not great. Um, You know what we're gonna do? Actually, this is crazy. We're gonna pop this so that we have more, we have bonus protection. So the cat won't just die instantly. I don't, I can't, I, I really, I can't avoid, or I can't, <laughs> I, I can't abide the thought of her dying that early. There we go. All right, get some armor shred on the man. Heal up a little bit. Okay, so you're done with your ult already. We might get another ult at some point. Um, let's just do this for now. We'll kind of bide our time. Just a little bit. I 
wasn't much damage there, cat. Kind of need better from you next time. Heal cat a bit. Kind of close to getting our ult here. This might get it for us if we call that assist. There we go. This will heal us some more. I don't know if it'll give us enough for our full amount. Now we got to start really trying to do damage, guys. Now that we got our ult and everything, we, we can go. It's time. The time has come. The time is now. It's like we're Marvin K. Mooney here. There we go. 56. Good enough. I feared this moment would come where we have no idea what we're going to use on anything. <clears throat> oh, so... We're going to try this Nihilus versus Malgus comp here, folks. This is, um... Sometimes this is just like an instant win. Like, you just, just, like, boom! You win! Win button. Um, but if, if they just kill... Oh, they're, they're hitting Scion. He's much more expendable. Um... I don't know. So I guess we just have to do it the hard way, I guess. Doing just fine without Tass? How could that be? Alright, we killed Talon at least. And our cooldowns are only slightly reduced. Very well. Alright, we'll see if we can actually kill him the hard way here, I, I guess. We really might not be able to, though. Poor old Zion, man. He's not a happy man. He's not a happy man. We can do this again. I thought we were going to be able to heal from that, damn it all. Oh, did Nihilus just dodge? What are you doing, bud? Oh, I don't know why I did that attack. Oops. I don't know, we might just time out, too. Just like the old school way of doing things, you know? Oh, here we go. I guess we'll just take it, huh? Just take the win, 56. I suppose that's acceptable. Does this only work if you have Treya Omi? Steve, yeah. Yep, you need the Treya Omicron. Absolutely. <laughs> yes. Alright, we're gonna try Maul here. I, I don't really... We're gonna have to kill Malak twice. That, that's pretty sketch, folks. I, I don't... I don't really know if that's gonna pan out for us, frankly, but... We do have the Candorous Omi on our side. And hopefully we'll at least be able to kill the two adds. Like that that would be that would be nice. I mean obviously we want to go for the win, but I did mod armor to be the weakest though, so hopefully hopefully we'll be able to just uh, win, you know? Alright guys, I'm pretty nervous about this, if I'm just being honest. I'm being honest and I'm being nervous, because we have to kill Malak twice if we want to win. Okay, so, I'll look at, oh no, oh that's not good, oh dear lord, no, that's what happened, why is he going first? Oh, jeez, alright, so, oh man. I'm just trying to see here, like, are we going to actually get a turn before Revan just kills us? <sighs> man. Because if we can, if we can just do basics here. No, I, I did, I tested this. What, what went wrong? I wonder if I'm using the wrong Kron or something. Hmm. Well, we gotta, we gotta go, guys. Um, jeez, man, that's not cool.
Yeah, so now we're feared. Oh, okay, so Maul's still gonna get a turn here kind of soonish, actually. We, uh, we just won't get the benefit of Candorous. Hmm, okay, so hopefully we'll kill Basti at least, and maybe even be able to kill Revan here at the end. All right, killed her, kill him. Yes, okay, all right. Well, I wouldn't say it's another happy landing exactly, because armor is toast now. Yeah, I don't even know if we kill Malak twice now, guys. Or once, I mean. Oops, didn't mean to do that one. Um, oh yeah, we'll do this though, real quick. Yeah, this is force strain. It doesn't do that much because of all that bonus protection, at least. Oh, we could have done one there, huh? Hmm, don't love that. Okay. Kill them once. Hmm. He's got his three, so it doesn't get a bonus turn, so it does have a lot of turn meter right now. Which isn't great. Um, I guess if we do this, Candrus is gonna get a bunch of bonus turn meter though, hopefully. Yeah, okay. Well that was enough to keep us like almost almost like hoping that we're gonna stay alive. Gosh, this death mark thing is also giving me anxiety, folks. Okay, so a little tap here. Candorus gets to go to town a little bit. Now we do this. Candorus goes to town a little bit again. Dear Lord, you gotta stop the cut that out, Malak. I feel a lot better if I had armor here, but I think we might be able to just get through it. There we go. <laughs> that was that was not an efficient zone, guys, but we we made some cool things happen at least. So it's in the back. Oh, look at that. He's got his own cron. Oh, he doesn't have the Candorous cron, though. Fun. For us. When they defeat an enemy, they take a bonus turn. It's going to be more cool in fives. Uh, let's see. Start of the encounter. Weakest ally. Okay, so they gain bonus turn meter. Gosh. I thought we were dead, folks. We, we came... We adapted okay though, didn't we? That was that was okay. Oh, he's got Afra in the back too. <laughs> oh. oh ho ho. And then he's got Grievous with IG. Hmm. Gosh, this Afra squad gives me anxiety too. I I did keep the right team for it though. Well, I don't know if it works, but. I kept the team that I feel like should work for it, okay? I don't think Afra is immune to stun, so that's that's probably good. Alright, so we use Sith Eternal here. And I guess we can take Watt. We, we don't have armor available, but Watt, Watt would be nice. I would like that a Watt. And then who else? Like, I mean, we could bring... I guess I do like the Brute Alpha here, guys. He's, he's nice because then you can get your tank back after a little bit. And I think I have a pretty nice heal, health cron for for this guy. Yeah, here we go. 49% health, little uh, little armor, and then as his friends die, he gets stronger. What's not to like about it? Hmm. This makes me nervous, but we'll do it anyways. Okay, so let's see. I'll um, put this on you. Thank you. And then I think we just put these on these two guys. Eventually we we'll kill Sorty. I like the idea of killing Ben at an opportune time. Yeah, we can even put this on you. Like a Ben just in hiding here in isolation. All 
All right, well, there's our Brute Alpha gone. Our Brute, I should say. It's Brute all. Let's get our friend back, though, for now. Hmm. All right, well, we don't want you gaining turn meter. So we'll take away your things that give you turn meter. I don't really care. Let's just do that real quick. We're kind of close to getting our alt here, guys. Close-ish. Hmm. Okay, he just gave us the healing immunity thing. But he's stealth. I don't like that, of course. We're gonna do this though. We gotta get healing immunity gone uh, if we can. I think. I think we're supposed to do that right now. I don't know. I could be wrong. That that might have been a huge misstep. In fact, folks. Oh, Ray's not gonna get to 60% here though. I don't think. Maybe she will, though. Here, let's try this. Let's just uh, gamble just a little bit here, guys. Hopefully she... Do a whirlwind. Or do do a lifeblood now, Ray. Please. Please do a whirlwind. No. I, I said whirlwind. What I meant was lifeblood. Stupid. Stupid, Ray. You stupid head. You dunderhead. There we go. And okay, now we can kill Ben. He's not gonna come back. Excellent. All right, you guys were hoping to just see a ton of really low scoring one shots, right? That was what your goal was to see today. Because if it was, then you're in luck. That's all I've been getting. That's just, it's in the cards today, apparently. Poor old sorties just kind of out of sorts right now, of course. Yeah, just keep doing that, Ray. That's pretty helpful for me. In fact, if you do that, Okay, now we really need to zap you and make sure... Oh, come on now. She's going to heal from this. Don't like that at all. The health steal is a big deal, actually. Needed to get land that lightning on her. So otherwise, she'll just health steal her way to victory. And that is not cool, as they say. At least it's a thing that I say isn't cool. All right, as riveting as that blow for blow was, I'm glad that it's over. And we have, in fact, killed Ray. Very good. What kind of Kron does Luke have? Hell steel potency, some protection. Hmm. Honestly, I think we can just punch this team in the head with some troopers, is what I think. Why don't we do that? Uh, what kind of cron do we want? I don't even know if we need a cron for this, to be honest, guys. Seems like crit damage doesn't do anything for us, though. Well, the offense would. Yeah, this one doesn't do much for us, but it does a little bit at least. And we could use Iden here as well. We can use Iden elsewhere though. This this team usually, usually, there's no issues in this fight. Usually it's a pretty clean fight. This would be like our first clean fight though, if it happens. Okay, so give this to you. Give this to you. Give this to you. Alright, you gotta punch more times than that. Okay, more times than that, please. More There we go. Okay, so they got they got one they got they got some shots off, I guess. Um Okay, see so can we just kill Chupio real quick? All right, and his furry head. Fifty six? Alright, that's good enough. All right, so we got General Skywalker here. I mean, I think we may as well just use the counter we have been using for him, which is 
these two guys plus someone else. Who? Ninth Sister. Where are you, Ninth Sister? There you are. All right. Remember, she does AoE Fear. Mary J is a relic, nine dark. Fair enough, man. Mm hmm. Guess we can look at the Kron. I don't think it's gonna change our minds. It's a lot of armor. It's a little bit of protection. It's pretty good. I, I faced one that was this thick previously. I think we should be okay. I hope. I don't. Know. It's it's tricky though. This is a, this isn't a relic nine one either, so that's gonna be a little bit nice for us at least. Um, okay, so we'll start with this, and then we'll have our puppy dog, Star Killer, just follow us about. Oh, we didn't get ability block on Rex. That's a little bit sad. All right. Oh, we did get ability block on General Skywalker. On the General. Um, okay, let's do this, just so we can work, get a little bit of work done on fives. It didn't really seem like we got much work done. Okay, let's fear all of them. Here, okay, wonderful. Let's do a hit and a hit. We're not really doing that much damage to Skywalker. I guess maybe this armor thing is more, uh, is a little more helpful than than I was hoping for. Oh, uh, let's see. We're gonna go before him. Oh, we missed anyways. What are you doing? And we're not doing much damage at all. This is. I'm starting to feel a little bit more fear here, folks. To be honest. Okay, so we could do this. This will do more damage, maybe. I don't remember. Um. Gonna just make a super clone here. Okay, let's fear him before he can actually take a turn. Wonderful. Man, my sister is really not feeling it though. She's gonna die here. We're, I feel like we're gonna lose this actually, guys. I thought we were gonna be fine, but I, I'm kind of, kind of under the opinion that we won't be now. In fact, we will not. In fact, be fine. Um, yeah, we gotta do this just to sit him down. My sister's gonna die here like like a dog. Oh my gosh. Okay, well, um, tell you what, let's just try to pummel him to death real quick. Tell you what, if we do this, oh, that was the wrong button. I meant to do Merciless Massacre. Oops. Um, okay, I really want our Star Destroyer of Healing now, please. Thank you. Hopefully that will at least kill him instantly. There we go. Not sketch at all. <laughs> Alright, all that defense did actually make a difference. Alright, and then we gotta figure out what we're gonna do against. There's a mall, that, that mall team down south is pretty tricky, and then the Afra team, of course, is also tricky. We can do those, and then after that, I don't know if it's smooth sailing exactly, but we should be able to at least get a one shot. I don't know. Of course, how many GLs? I guess he has four GLs for offense. Um, and, and Star Killer. Yeah. Might end up okay for us, we'll see. I don't know, I didn't, I didn't keep Malak just to do this solo, but the fact that we have him... Seems like a wasted opportunity if we don't. It's been a really long time. Who do I go for first? Do you guys know? I actually don't remember who the best one to go for first would be. Alright, tank allies defeated, health, offense, the, the crit damage is a little bit silly for Malak. It's not really a crit machine, but so we can try it. First or video on first order, consistently countering executor. I, I haven't made one yet, really, I don't think. Okay, I think we gotta do... Should we just hit shock first? EJ's story says shock first. Oh, look at how much health she has. Jeez. 
Right, so this should stun her. Well, sometimes stun her. I don't remember. I think because I have one stack, it stuns her sometimes. I kind of want to keep her in striking distance to be able to just kill her with one force drain, right? Like that's kind of the goal. Gosh, they're doing a lot more damage than I was hoping for, I'll tell you that. Hey, Zacer with a gifted sub to Juice Box. That's awesome, man. Thank you. <laughs> Good lad. All right, so Shock's gone. She gone. All right, let's let Ark just do his own ignorant thing for a little bit, shall we? He's a scary a-hole. Um, it's a little bit scared. I just don't want him to, I don't want him to hit me back yet. That's what I really don't want. Okay, so now we can do this. Force drain a bit. And now that we've got three, we can start stunning and doing all sorts of also ignorant things. So we should get full banners here. 59, wonderful. That was not the intent. I actually, I thought, I'm, conf I'm confused because I thought I put him on defense, but apparently my opponent has a little weaker defense than I thought he had, had to deal with. We've gotten a lot of our impressive kills out of the way, though. I think this coming one, this one against Afra is going to be pretty cool. If I hope it works, but if it does, I think it'll be epic. Okay, so we've got Dash here, and kind of wanted Han. Whatever. There's Chewie. Now whatever wherever Han is, we'll find him. There we go. So Dash Han Chew, and then. They have this Kron that when that they get 100% turn meter whenever they use their... It's, so we have to use Hondos here. Um, so on the basic ability, not to mention they have 31% crit damage, which is nice for them. Um, on a basic ability, reset their cooldowns and gain 100% turn meter. So Han will go twice in a row, basically, against Afra. And Chewie will assist every time. So it seems to me like that'll just kill Afra, but I'm not sure. I rage got a 2023. 20, That's a great score, man. I'm jealous. I hope I can get that on this account, on this fight. I don't know if I can. We haven't failed any, but man. Okay, so she normally gets 100% turn meter. So we get the bonus turn because we're shoot, we shoot first. Uh, so we get to go. We can. St I think she's stunnable, isn't she? Yeah. And then I get another turn here. So we could do this. And then we get another turn. And there we go. Oh, let's just stun the guy who does all the damage here. Oh, he's going to do a lot of sh damage here anyways. Damn. Oh okay, yeah, well this this turned like a little scarier. Not not quite all the way scarier, but you know. There we go. Oh, I should have used a basic on dash to start with, huh? Oops. Okay, well I'll, I'll remember that next time. I like the idea of stunning, but then I could have gotten that, that like it's not a bonus turn, but it's it's kinda close to it. I don't know, so if we take Hux, we have enough good teams. We really don't need to. We can take, I think we can take Hux. The problem, I just don't know if we can afford. Like we might just get, we might still just lose this fight, in fact. I don't I don't think this is a fight that we lose, but it's very possible. We get extra armor here, which is nice against everyone except for Maul, of course. Maul does all the extra hitting. Or does the, he does do extra hitting, but he does the, um, he does true damage, so it doesn't matter as much. Let's see, potency isn't gonna matter for us that much either. All right, this, this should still be okay. This is the one that gives me the most of all the, the most anxiety, I suppose. All right, so start with the poke here. And she started with the turn meter. All right, so now we're gonna hand the turn to you again. And again, we're gonna do the poke here. So they're just not getting all these bonus turns. There we go, we got the retribution going. I'll just dispel things and call the assist. He's gone. And tell you what, let's just try to kill him. No? Let's just try to try to kill him. Yes. Okay, they apparently killed all of our protection at some point, but very well. So I I don't I think the I think the I think Gidme works fine on this, I think. 
so they're gonna get bonus turn meter on Dooku. He'll go first. He'll just do. He'll just give them turn meter though. Is all he'll do. And then we should just be able to kill Savage pretty easy. Yeah, let's, do, let's use Gidme here. Okay. So yeah, Duke will go first. And then hopefully, hopefully they won't get any other turns because Gideon will reduce everyone's turn meter. It should be okay. Right, quest cape. I, I just, I don't know what the plan is. And if the plan is to just increase our total number of teams that we have to use, it's not really my favorite, frankly. I'll save this just in case we want to use, what's his name on something. Some tenacity and armor. The armor sounds okay. I think, is there something with health? It's not much health. That could be okay though. Alright, let's, let's see how this goes, folks. I think this should win. I hope. Alright, so reduce everyone's turn meter except for Padme's here, of course. And then... Um, can she just one-shot Savage? There we go. There we go. Pretty silly how that works, but there we are. There you have it. Uh, let's put this on you so that we only lose banners on one person. Um, yeah, let's just increase these stacks a little bit. He's going to be full of protection, though. So I guess we could set everyone on fire. I wish we could target Dooku right now. We came pretty close to just one-shotting this, this guy anyway, so didn't we? Gonna take a little bit to actually get through this guy, though. There we go. Alright, stealing my turn, or stealing my banners here, Dooku. I guess that's pretty standard, though. Oh, maybe we can just stun him here. Yeah. Take that. Um, Alright, let's just make sure. We drop three. It's two. Nice. I thought we'd drop two from Gideon. Two from Gideon and then one from R2, but apparently not. <laughs> Just killing Savage instantly there is so satisfying, isn't it, guys? Because <laughs> he has so much health. So much health. All right, let's see what kind of ships he's got. If he's got really annoying ships, we're probably, probably just going to do it later. He does have Executor. I don't know. Does that mean Profundity's not here? He kept Profundity. Put Executor down. Look at that, he put, the, he put the fleet that I struggle with most on. Interesting. We'll see how that goes. We'll see how that plays out for us. Not sure what I want to do. So I think one of the things that we get stuck on, guys, I think we have to kill K2 first. That's that's a big big thing that I, I made a mistake that I made last time. I couldn't kill, couldn't kill Adrad because he just kept interrupting. So... We could, do the, we could do Jedi Revan. We could also just do the health equalization thing. We, we could just take Luke. Jedi Luke. I don't know if I like that, though. These guys are pretty quick. The extra offense from Revan's nice. Let's see, so this one has crit chance and crit damage. But less health. I like the extra health here, to be honest. And the armor. The armor's nice, too. <sighs> okay, well... I'm, I'm not totally convinced this works, guys. Let's try it. Pretty nervous. I think we kill K2 first, even though they're gonna revive him.
Apparently that went to him. Send this to you, because it will get turn meter and stuff, but this will reduce their max health and protection and stuff. Okay, so we're doing some uh, okay damage to him at least. Alright, have Luke give a little tap tap taparoo. Okay, so K2, he gone. Okay, let's get rid of these buffs. Hand it to the person with the turn meter. Good. It's on this guy. It's already up 65 though, dear lord. Okay. We gotta move here, guys. We gotta move! Can he be ability blocked? I don't remember. Doesn't kind of, kind of doesn't look like it, does it? Eighty six already. Come on now. This is terrifying, folks. Should giving it to Revan. Okay, add it to the guy who can hit hard, though. Okay, got the kill. She can still be stunned, though. So we're just gonna go for the straight up kill. But she can still revive. Oh no! No no no! No! Okay. Okay. Good. Oh, she can't. Oops. That's okay, actually. That might actually heal him a little. No? Well, that got scary for about three seconds, and then we accidentally killed him on a counter, so I didn't even have a chance to really get let the terror take hold. Alright, so Grievous with the Scoundrel. We're gonna... Poor old Wampa is just not gonna be used this time. That seems like... Seems almost impossible. Hmm... Maybe we'll use him on that raid team. I don't, I don't know. I don't know if that works. Um, oh, these guys are still well, I'm curious to see how this goes, honestly. Levels 85 to 100 of currency to punish hoarders. I mean, that that would actually make some sense, in fact. What do we want to do here? Okay, so we, don't, we want to steal his turn meter and make it so that he's, he can't do anything for a little bit. Because then, we just want to blitz this guy if we can. Let's just see if we can take him out as quick as we can. Don't want him to be able to do anything. Okay, he's gone. That's good. We'll save that heal cron, healing cron for just a little bit, guys. Um, here, we get a bonus for three stacks, so that'll be good. Uh, we could put torture on him as well for funsies. Uh, let's just keep doing basics here. I kind of like like the idea of of Grievous is just hanging out here till till we kill the guy. Yep, cool. And we have damage immunity. So that's good. Let's put torture on him. This will give us uh well I thought it was gonna hmm. Okay, let's let's do heal a bit here. Now, hopefully it doesn't get an AoE or anything inconvenient for us. I don't know if that actually healed their protection enough. Yeah, it did, okay. Alright, I executed that one okay, at least. Hmm. I don't know, there's something that appeals to me about a level cap increase, guys. Like, I'm not going to argue that strenuously about it, even though it, do it really doesn't seem likely to me to happen. It still... There, there's something about it that I'm like, oh, that sounds kind of nice. I would kind of like that, you know? <laughs> For some reason, it's, it's appealing. I don't know why it is, but it is, so... Alright, who are we taking here? We want Death and we want Storm, I think. And then let's just take the one with a bunch of crit damage, shall we? Just kill Finn immediately if we can. Something nice about using Iden because you don't have to check speeds. Uh, 
Well, I didn't kill him. That's too bad. Okay, let's increase cooldowns here, actually. Let's just kill him before we do anything else. Kill him. Okay, Stormtrooper's about to take a turn, so we can do this. And then we can do that. You can get with this, you can get with that. You can get with this, you can get with that. You can get with this, you can get with that. I say you get with this, because this is where it is. Wow, she's dodging a lot, isn't it? That dodgy minx. I can get with whatever legend, alright? I'm not afraid. Let's do more damage at least. We, we won't get we won't get that uh, thing to stick, but okay, this will call a mass assist. Hopefully it just kills you though. So just very a very dodgy minx tonight. There we go, 57. She shouldn't have had she didn't have shouldn't have dodged that much. Like I know that there was foresight involved and that she her mastery is is evasion, but that was some pretty poor RNG. Alright. 1600. That's, that's not bad, but going into fleets, huh? Yeah, they use the they use the relic le or the the character levels as balancing points as well. So, I mean, there there is that. Um, I don't know how, do, how does Empire with the new ship do with the scythe do against this triple attacker comp? I actually don't know. Does that work? I've heard that it works. I think we're just gonna do this though, because I'm not gonna take the time to research it right now. Maybe it's foolish of me. So the comp does change a little here, though. So we have Silencer and uh, Echelon, and then we take the Special Forces TIE Pilot uh, as the third. And we take these other two, and that's all we're going to take here, I think. And the, the first move is just... we I, All the first moves are dedicated to killing IG-2000. Because we can't, if we can focus down CAD, maybe we do that instead, but IG-2000 is the one that's the scariest right now. And CAD starts in stealth anyway, so start just like, like if Houndstooth was here, we'll hit him with this. And then we don't have advantage yet, so we'll just try to stun at the very least. No, uh, so we'll call the assist here. Alright, we got him. Excellent. And then they'll kill my echelon almost certainly. Yeah, look at that. They even get assists with this guy. Gosh, it's so gross, man. So much. Alright, so big hit on CAD here. Okay, we got, got two of them out. Wonderful. Okay. Now we take Shuttle in. Maybe he can do something for us. I don't know. Um. Okay, well, let's just dispel and reduce his turn meter. Gosh, I think Houndstooth is just going to kill us, though, isn't he? Don't Please don't kill me. Oh, come on. Okay, take a turn. Maybe my... Oh, don't. Oh, my gosh. Okay, so end the turn to you. Maybe you stop having target lock on you now? Okay. Yeah, this this is the... Like, our, our TIE fighter is just... Uh, or whatever, our silencer is just going to die. Like a dog. So we'll just keep trying to get him healed and better. Uh, I can do the AoE here for funsies. Okay, yeah, this this might kill me now. Not quite. Okay, so let's dispel him as much as we can. Maybe we get a stun. Nice. Okay. Get another hit here. Um, and this is where we just have him go again. Oh, gosh. No fun. No fun. Um... How do I want to do this? And this guy, well, he's about to take a turn anyways. We wanted to stun. Um. We'll still make sure he gets a turn here before he goes. And then we're going to gamble a little bit. We're just trying to stun him, though. Nice. Okay. Have another turn. Oh, now we can't hit the other. Uh oh, that's not good. Um, there we go. Okay, killed him. Wonderful. Oops, should have shot the other guy. In fact, um, 
Oh yeah, okay, so he's getting a lot of turn meter still, so we're gonna we're gonna hit him. There we go. Oh gosh, and now they Oh my gosh. And after all of that, after all of that, we just get aced out. Damn it all. <sighs> okay, let's see if we could kill the Razor Crest at least. Probably not, but uh, that's so so sad. Alright. We got our other friend in here. So we can get um, I don't know, some damage on Houndstooth or something. I wanted to get target lock. You know what, I'm, I'm just being foolish here. I'm, I'm doing the wrong hits on the wrong things. Ugh. I'm all discombobulated, folks. Um, okay, so we're gonna, we might just look for a place to time, to time out, in fact, guys. Okay, give these guys some turn meter here. So we want to wait till the Houndstooth taunts, guys. Once he taunts, then we're going to time out. Well, there's the big heal. You know what? Let's, let's wait until Executor also gets the mass assist, if, if we can survive that long. Okay, there's the taunt. Hopefully this is the mass assist. Oh, no, this is <laughs> this is the I kill your ship. Okay, well, that, that's not great. <clears throat> we should be able to finish this off, though. Well, that was that was looking so good for a minute there, guys. Gosh, we're gonna drop so many banners in fleets. He put the right fleets down for sure. Congrats to him. Okay, let's actually do the Radis fight first, just just because it's the scariest in a lot of ways. Hmm. I don't want all of these guys. This is a lot of reinforcements, guys. We're not going to get great banners here. Should we keep this guy here? Seems kind of important. Let's just use him, though. All right, let's go. At the very least, the hope is that we can get the kill on the Executor itself. Obviously, draining more banners, but we should be able to finish this off fairly easily with with that. And we hopefully we'll be able to kill the, um, whatever it's called as well, the Razor Crest. Okay, so we can do the big hit. I guess the big hit isn't that effective against a guy who has... Oh, I should have kept that in reserve. What am I doing? Man, how's the... Okay, um... So we can just get turn meter from this guy. Let's see, we'll call the mass assist here. I think this is a mass assist. Maybe the other button was a mass assist. Oops. Oopsies. Alright, we can do this. I want to do this because that actually gets us closer to our ult. Spell kind of there. Gosh, please don't kill my ship, please. Please. Well, there's the mass assist. Take that, Hound's Tooth. You didn't see that coming, did you? We're almost doing okay damage there. We just gotta kill their ship, guys. That's that's the big thing here. And I think we have the right tools. I don't know, it depends on which which ship comes in. Falcon kinda helps here. Let's see. Does more damage against debuffs. Okay. Let's get rid of one of your buffs at least. Let's try spinning, that's a neat trick.
All right, we can dispel that. This actually does more damage with this. There we go. Okay, that was actually decent. That was decent. For cleanup, it was decent. All right, so now we'll use Malevolence here, I believe. Hmm, or do we use, let's use Empire on this, maybe? Empire gets terrible banners on this. Malevolence doesn't lose to this usually, at least. We'll use Malevolence, it's fine. Should have just gone to my alt, guys. It's okay, I forgive you. Legend, story of your life, I missed that. Ridiculous, man. <laughs> My son calls me Mark as well. No, he doesn't. What do we want to do? Because we can. Oh, stunning him doesn't do anything because the they'll just dispel it. Yeah, that was foolishness. Okay, this 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 is a set to get a little sketch, guys. All right, we'll do the AOE just to get rid of their foresight, though, at least. Okay, try to get some. Oh, we just missed the Falcon. Damn it all. I would really love to be able to kill this uh, bomber before anything else happens to me. Cool. Everyone is sadness right now. Um, so we're gonna get the spy in here. This won't kill him, will it? Shoot, man. We don't have any buzz droids, and he's got a bunch of she's got a bunch of protection, and we've got a bunch of people in days. Let's see. This big hit won't do anything. But he's about to just kill everyone. Let's just do the big hit on the Falcon and see how that goes. We'll at least get rid of one of those stacks. Okay, the drive-by was not pleasant, but okay. Kinda got through it a little bit. Um Okay, well, let's get rid of the foresight here at the very least. Um, and this one, we might be able to get some assists going at least. Okay, get some more of these. This guy's gonna die, of course. He's gonna die. Everyone dies. It's like a French movie, dear lord. Mother of God. Hmm. So to get Poe out here. The Falcon poses some serious problems, of course, but uh, not not nearly so many problems as uh, at, at the very start when that the nonsense was originally happening. Um okay, Poe is gonna do a lot of huge hits here pretty soon. Okay, so we can slaughter a couple of our dudes, I suppose. It's no fun. That wasn't cool. That ain't sweet. Uh, we could do the AoE though. Summon someone. Gosh. Just getting all dodgy. Okay, all the resistance are gone. All of our banners are gone. Everything. Everything is gone. There we go. Terrible banners. 64 is awful. Just atrocious. Dear Lord, I hope we even get over 2,000 points. I, I don't even know if we will. I don't know. Because we could try the new ship, shall we? Where we're going, we don't need banners, says the wolf. It's true, man. Why is the room gone? My dog calls me Bark. Whoa. You gotta tell your dog to knock that crap off, man. That ain't sweet. I don't know if this is the right comp, guys. We're just jumping in. We're just going nuts here. We're just winging it. Wanging it. We're setting rebels on fire, setting noobs on fire. Yeah, 
Hey, let's get some target lock on you as well. And some death on you. Maybe some target lock on you. Some death, no? How about on you? I guess I should I keep forgetting that these aren't actually uh, rebels. Uh, like, they're not the original, at least. They're not the, uh... Or not the, the rebels, they're not original TIE fighter pilots, I should say. Oh, hello there, spy. I think, did that heal me? No, that just evened us out. I don't even know what these abilities do, guys. Um, hold on. Okay, so that healed his protection some, at least, or some health or something. So that'll be good for us. Cool. And now we see why, now we ask, why the hell is this guy even here? What would you say you do here? I shouldn't have brought so many reinforcements, guys. I kind of forgot. So we don't really even have room for reinforcements. All right, well, we got one decent banner. It's probably pretty bad overall score, though, guys. Okay, 2021. 20, we failed once. Hmm. We're, we're, we're definitely vulnerable. This guy's a really good player. I have a really strong defense, though, so we'll have, we'll have to see. All right, guys, that's it for this. Um, we'll see how he does against my defenses. My defenses are pretty obnoxious as well. Uh, the back zone is especially just uh, why. Why is it the? Why do you choose to be the things you choose to be?